Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm actually going to be giving you some quick tips and we are going to be talking about straight stitching lines. You'd be surprised how many times I hear people say that they don't know how to sew a straight line. Now, there are several different feet on the market that you can use for this and there's a whole bunch of different techniques and I'm just gonna show you a few of my favorites. Now, first things first is this little metal plate that you have on your sewing machine has a grid on it and that's built in to kind of help you with seam allowances and you can use those for straight lines as well. Um, one of the big ones I'm gonna show you real quick, I'm using a straight stitch foot here, but this is a magnetic little bumper that you can put that sticks to the side of your throw plate. And you can just kind of stick your fabric next to it you can also use like an elastic band or tape off side of your machine and use that as a guide as well. The problem with this plate, this little magnetic thing, is you can only do that first line because the whole top of your machine is probably not metal. Which brings us to the second foot. Now this is a walking foot and I actually use this with a side metal guide arm. This is actually really good for quilting, but if you're doing any kind of like, um, like stitching straight lines through any parts of your costume, this little metal bar slides to the back of it and you can use your ruler to measure out from the needle and the distance. So you'd sew a straight line and put that little metal bar on that straight line and sew parallel all the way down. Now, if that's too big of a foot, you can always use a gauge or a grid foot. And I can't remember where I got this, so I will put this in the description box below. But this little foot's really cool. I've actually used this quite a few times when I've had to create some pinstriping on some of my costumes. And it's really easy, it snaps on. Now, the biggest thing I'm gonna tell you guys is watch the lines and make sure that the lines are matching up. Don't look at the needle. That's probably one of the biggest mistakes I've seen people make is they keep looking at the needle and that'll get you in a pinch real quick. Now, the last tip I'm gonna give you is pre-mark out your lines. Use a piece of Taylor's chalk and go through and just chalk out your line as quick as you can. And what you'll wanna do, like I said before, don't watch your needle. The needle is not gonna move anywhere besides up and down. <laughs> Watch the side of your fabric or watch your grid line. Like right here, we're actually going to line that little white chalk line with the very center slit in the toe of this foot. And that's what's going to guarantee the straight line. Really easy. So go out, have fun, practice. That's the biggest thing I could say is practice and have fun with it. Now, if you had any other questions or any comments, leave them in the comment section below. And if there's any other tips that you would like to know, definitely let me know as well. As always, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel before you leave. Follow me on all other social media, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.